right then, I got cut off. I, I hope the other video is saved. Um, but I've just put my energizer on. This thing. The energizer. So here we are. I've just come along this track, round the bend there. Past a couple of people with dogs a minute ago who quickly put the dogs on leads by the way there's no cows about I don't see what the harm is really but uh, at least they had they didn't know if I was a warden or anything I suspect anyway right over there we've got um, St John the Baptist Church getting further away from me now again as I continue this loop that I couldn't do last week because of the time factor and the weather wasn't very good. It was getting quite cold actually last week. It's quite windy again. Bridgewater keeps changing position. Right over there in the distance we've got St Mary's Church again. And with the naked eye I can actually see St John's Church as well. There's St Mary's look. Bridgewater the, with the tall spire. Over a bit we might see St John's. Might have gone too far. Oh there it is, that's St John's. Where I was baptized, christened. All those moons ago. I'm going to be doing the loop I didn't do last week. Over there we've got Cummage. Over there we've got Hinkley Point. Yeah, it's very handy this energizer because the battery um, is able to use the storage as I'm going along. Obviously you can, if you were, if I wasn't using the camera, I'd keep it plugged into the storage facility and it will um, store it, uh, charge it right up. You can, in fact, it's got enough on here to charge two cameras. Because I'm using it as I'm going, it's just as well, isn't it? Like I said, I ain't going to be able to come out here in the summer. Nice as it is. season. Any day now. I think it might wait until the seven boar has been up. I'm not sure. And the spring tides. They might wait for that. The river won't ever come up as high once all that's happened. Um, but they're definitely waiting for something. We still, still see a bit of surface water in the fields. They will know anyway. I mean, it's opposite. Uh, there's a reason for it. I think they get sort of foot rot and all this as well if they get um, if they stand in damp ground for long. You know, they get they get illnesses. I think if, um, if they hang around in the damp, so they like to, and they can get stuck. Of course, they can drown. Um, I don't think they're worried so much about the summer when it's raining and all that sort of thing. Beautiful, isn't it? Even though it almost looks blue. It's a muddy old river. I mean, Bridgewater used to have brickworks. Obviously, they used to use the mud. Yeah, this is all new to me never done this before and I know I've got to go right the way around in a loop to that opposite that village of Cummage. I've got to go right the way around under one of those beacons, those pylons, before I turn. So I've got to go whoosh, massive loop. 
and I've already done quite a big loop over that way, right over there. I've already done quite a big loop, but I've got no idea if this is really noisy, this video. Obviously, I know it won't be as noisy when I turn out of the wind. I'm, I'm going to turn off in a minute. But it's like a prairie here, isn't it? All open. I don't see why they couldn't just put a little electric fence up in some ways because, um, you know, people could walk here then without fear of... I mean, they do warn people if you ch that they, they know cows chase. They've already said if you've got a dog and you're getting chased, let the dog off the lead. They've already said that on the signs. So they do know that cows can do it and they, they don't, it don't make no difference to them. Don't make no difference to them. Yeah, well in a minute, I came, um, last week I came to a gate not far from over, just over there somewhere. But I've got to do this loop round first. So I'm doing, that's why I'm doing a bit of videoing as I go. Might need, um, editing, you know, and split, split, it's, it's very long. But I think it's nice to do a bit of continuity, but it just depends how windy it is, you see. So what I'm going to do now, yeah, I'm, I'm walking towards Bridgewater again now, and not on the snake bend. Looks like I'm going towards Bridgewater again. When earlier I was over the river, the cottages are over there I went through. I've just gone round in a big loop. I'm sort of running parallel with the river over there. It's not something you do every day, but the thing is, it is good. This would be good if you were running training. It's still good anyway. It's somewhere to come. That's a bit slightly different. But I think I'd probably only do it. Definitely, I'll do it again next year because I'll be thinking about it. I won't be able to do it in the summer. It's going to be winter time when I can do it. Or like this again, March. I've got to remember, March is okay for this. Right, over and out then for a minute. I'm just zooming. Yeah, over and out.